So the place that I went to uh, was after I was a monk for a week at the main temple. I said, wherever you want to send me, I go. So I went there. I uh, went to Wat pa Padipatham in Ban Keng, Chon Uttararit, North, North Thailand. That place uh, where I reached there, it was night time. It was so dark, right? Inside the, inside the forest, cannot see anything. So uh, I had one very small torchlight. So I went there, meet the acting abbot. So I went to the main hall. Uh, the main hall is pretty big. One big statue of the Buddha, that's it. I say, I bring you to your kuti. Kuti is the, is the hut where you stay. So I took a walk to the back of the temple, went to the forest, walked about 10, 10, about 10 15 minutes. Is there anyone here? What did you find? You are listening to Supernatural Confessions. Reach the hut, it's a small hut. And the toilet is not inside. You got to leave the hut to go to the toilet. And it was so dark, right? You put your hands in front of your face, you can't see your hands. It was pitch black. And later I realized, like at, at five in the evening, uh, it's really that it's really that dark because of the because of the uh, of the forest. So the first night I saw there are some pagodas around the around Makuti. And then I saw uh, this place where I saw this brick layout, like a rectangle over there with a small, small shade. That night when he left me, right, I go inside the, uh, go inside the hut, go inside the kuti. I started hearing all kinds of funky noises. Sounds like the pasar malam outside. I'm in the, I'm in the forest. There's nobody there, but I can hear adults running around, screaming, shouting, laughing, crying. He's like, what's happening, man? <laughs> so never mind. Next morning, three, uh, about three plus four, went to the went to the main hall. Went to the main hall, went for arms round, come back. I didn't sleep the first night. It was very, very, very noisy. At all. So I came back, uh, had the I had my breakfast. After that, uh, meet some of the lay people who came. Introduce myself, everything. Then uh, in the early afternoon, I went back to the kuti. I saw all the pagodas again. Took a closer look. It was actually two stones. They are pagodas, but they put the ashes inside the pagodas. So I went. I went to investigate the the brick structure so I, when i look inside right so i see black black then i saw a lot of ashes and everything oh this is where they burn the bodies then i went i uh i met one of the monks so i asked him about the the pagoda everything so then i found out this monks from hong kong so i can speak cantonese so i, I conversed with him in cantonese he told me that for most of the people who are the ashes who are put there uh people who drowned, died in accident, murdered, commit suicide, all the bodies nobody claim. They bring to the temple, burn, burn the day, they put the ashes there. So all the Rahaba one. The second second night, right, I became paranoid because I couldn't sleep. Uh it was 5 p.m., everything all peace black. I don't even dare to go to the toilet. Then I know that it's all these the, the, the entities are all the all those die tragic death. Right? So then I practice already, then I got uh, I also practice the the C the, the C Hermitage. Uh. So uh, I also have some mantras and stuff like that. But I was so paranoid, I I I, I became scared. Uh. I couldn't the uh, first time in my life I felt scared. I never scared of spirit. Man. Never scared of entities, ghosts and spirit. But that was the first time I actually I fear. I don't know why, but I just I couldn't control myself. I couldn't calm myself down. So the whole night I was paranoid. Whole night I was paranoid. So I started. I open my bag. I take out all my amulets. I wear all my amulets, all my tanga, all I tie. Then I sit down there and I start shaking. I cannot recall any mantra. I cannot recall any mantra. 
Then the that was the second night. Ah, cannot record any mantra. Then I took out my book. I open my book. Ah, uh, I try to recite the mantra. Right, cannot recite because when I try to recite, all I hear is my teeth, crack, 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 <laughs> it was quite awesome. I think back, it's quite awesome. You know, uh, 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 I was, I, I was scared shitless like a little girl, man. Second day, second night, didn't sleep. Went, went back to the kutik and hold the torch. Like walk very fast. I felt like a lot of eyes watching me. So the trip back to the to 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 to, to the main hall. I went to Armstrong. So I went to look for the Albert, the acting Albert. The acting Albert is a uh, Taiwanese. Found there a lot, all, 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 some of the monks all from other countries, man. So I went, I went to look for him, then I asked him, uh, do you think you can call the main monastery? Not? He said, why? I think I don't stay here. <laughs> <laughs> so I, told him, I think I don't want to stay here. Now you're a rabba, no? <laughs> I think I cannot take it. They say, you really cannot take it, man? Aya, nothing one, ma. you don't think so much. Ah. You, 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 it's, it's not real, it's not real, it's your mind. <laughs> he told me it's not real. I stay here 14 years already. He told me that I stay 14 years and nothing happened to me. So I was like, oh, okay, no. you know. <laughs> After that, the, that's the third day, went back to the monastery. Oh, sorry, went back to the Kuti. From fear, it went to become anger. So I be, uh, from being afraid, right, I became aggressive. So until uh, I was wearing I was wearing the sapon robes, so I tried not to swear. I wanted to swear and I wanted to swear all these entities, but I didn't swear. I said, I not scared of you. You want you come, you come. Who come also I whack. I will use my mantra I'll whack you. Okay. So that night I not scared anymore. I never take the sapon robe cover and shake. Okay. <laughs> Uh, the, the night before, I think the sapphire room cover is sick. So the night was also at the start, they didn't know. So I took the my book, I start chanting. So I chant, I chant the mantra is to smack all the spirit one. I challenge a fight. Yeah. So chant, 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 until I got a shock. The plunge, I got a shock. I really got, I got stunned. The the window right slam bam so i jog i got shocked hey. then the first thing i oh, poltergeist activity not only sound not got poltergeist activity i was like next thing i know that i start. I, I wanted to chant again right i started the door open up bam slam on its own i had a very i had a very bad feeling so i took out one of my amulets one of my prize amulets now that I believe very much uh, is uh, can smack spirit one. Uh. And I took out the amulet, right? I look at the amulet. The head broke. The amulet head broke. That means I use my amulet to fight. Uh, fight until uh, the amulet cannot whack. Uh, tau, tau chi, uh, so the head broke. So that means, uh, you know, so pump it already. Pump it, pump it, don't pump it. So. I went to the, uh, until Tong until didn't sleep no all the way never sleep no went went to the main hall wait for the abbot to come out abbot come out I tell the abbot no you can call the main main monastery no. you tell him I want post out he say why is post out I say no 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 not not post out I want to change monastery if you if if you don't let me leave this place I will disrobe. <laughs> so you see are you why that then the 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 hon the honky monk him, hey, uh, I sat down with him. Then he, then he told me, you think probably uh, what decision you gonna make? And then you ask yourself uh, why did you come in the first place? So that sort of like woke me up. Uh, gave me a gave me an affinity. Uh, uh, like why why did I come in the first place? Then why am I afraid of this thing? If I want to do what I scared. After everything, I went back to the Kuti, right? I I, I was like lost, huh? I was like lost. I sat down. Next thing I know, I just... Just like that. 
I took my bag. I removed everything, you know, all, all my chains, my amulet, everything all removed. Put inside the bag, my tanga, the belt, everything all take out, put inside the bag. Everything removed, kosong except my saffron rope. Uh, four plus in the, four plus already in the day afternoon, oh, dark, the sky dark, dark already. I open the door, I step outside, loud, loud, I say, my name, Okay. Yeah, a little can I did right can blow out my name, huh? My party name. I come here right. Is to stay to practice. My life, one life only. You want you take. Uh. Die also, I won't leave this place. You can try as high as you want. Haunt me as much as you want. If you can, you kill me. Uh. I will not leave. Uh. I don't care. This is my kuti. Are you staying here for good? Huh? I have a bear inside. That night, no disturbance. Huh? So actually, it was a test. Huh? The Lego and that. I, everything Lego start from zero. <laughs> My teacher never teach me anything. I never learned anything. Everything cultivated through meditation. What did you find? You are listening to Supernatural Confessions.